way you move so sexy did I forget to mention. Let's play motherfucking Odd Top Dimensions. Welcome everyone to day 20 of Shmuptember. Today, we're playing a little bit of Odd Type Dimensions. Now, my original plan was to play one of the Odd Type games on the Wii U Virtual Console, or the Wii Virtual Console for that matter. But apparently, IREM, which is the makers of Odd Type and other assorted old games, um, decided to take them off of there. Now, I'm not sure if it's because they released this, or because they're just, they didn't like what Nintendo was doing, or the agreement expired and they didn't renew it, or whatever reason, it's not on the Virtual Console anymore, because they used to have R-Type 1, 2, and 3 on the Virtual Console. All of them are gone, so I was like, what the fuck am I going to do? Then I heard about this game, R-Type Dimensions, and I was like, cool, remake? Like a, but, come to find out, here we are on the title screen, and it's a freaking compilation of R-Type 1 and 2. And I feel like it might actually have R-Type 3 as well. You might have to unlock it. I didn't look this up beforehand, but I have a, I have a feeling that you might be able to unlock R-Type 3 here. Anyways, regardless of that, we'll probably get a chance to try both of them. Because most likely, I'm going to suck ass. Just like I did at, uh, what's it called, Gradius. R-Type is a very similar type of game. They're both very similar shooters that basically went head-to-head -head back in the day. They both have three iterations. I mean, at least originally on the Nintendo and Super Nintendo Cancels. Let's just start off with the first R-Type and see how it goes. Now, one thing I'll mention real fast. Oh, fuck. You have an infinite amount of lives. <gasps> oh, I didn't even know that. That's amazing. Okay, we'll be able to play through both games then if I go fast. Now, the other thing is there's graphical modes. I was about to say. You can switch between the old graphics and the new graphics, which I think is amazing. And I'm probably going to do that as we go. And it looks like, oh, we have eight stages to go through. We need to stop talking and hurry the hell up then. Hopefully the stages are short, but my point is we can switch seamlessly between old graphics and new graphics just by pressing one button while we're playing, and that's one thing I intend to utilize at least once per stage just to kind of see. I think we're starting off with the new graphics, but I'll definitely be switching it around as we go. Anyways, here's the new graphics. Look how fancy they are. Yeah, buddy. I'm glad there's an infi infinity mode or infinite mode. That's so nice. So fucking nice. Oh my god, we can charge our beams? That's new. That's one I didn't expect. Oh, come on with this. Well, there goes our first life. <laughs> All right. About ready to switch 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 dimensions. How funny this is called our type dimensions is we can literally switch into another dimension. Also, I got a familiar or something. Oh wow, it goes way ahead of us. That's very helpful. Thank you. Get out of here, alien. You alien thing, you. I don't Oh my god. Okay. This is already getting a little out of hand. Let's go to old school graphics. Wow. Look at the difference. I like the fade, too. Did you see that fade? That little bit of a fade into it? I like that. Get out of here, aliens. I'm trying to play with the joystick. Also, oh, I'm playing this on PS3, if that wasn't clear. I don't know if you could tell from the main title screen. It may not have been clear. I'm not sure if this is on anything else, actually. It might be on the Xbox also, but I'm not entirely certain of that. In fact, I don't think it is. I think it's only on PS3, or at least P maybe it's on. You can play. Might be able to play on Vita. Uh, I'm not sure. Either way, I'm playing it on PS3. That's all that really fucking matters. What are we playing it on, right, Neo? All right. Any hoozle. Oh, come on with this little ship. Come on now. One thing I'm liking better than Gradius already is the non-checkpoint. Fuck! I crashed into the ceiling. Well, we're doing so well so far. Is the non-checkpoint thing where you don't have to go back to the fucking checkpoint every time you die. Which is good and bad. It's it's good if you if you like a game that requires some skill. It's bad if you're like me and you suck and you just want to see the game. Now, granted, Gradius 3 did have a little bit of a cop-out for me. It let me get 30 lives, but yet I still sucked so hard that I couldn't even handle it with that. So, there's just no excuse for me. I don't get an excuse because I'm just shitty. That's all there is to it. I should, why am I not holding this shit down? That seems incredibly useful. Because if you look up there, there's like a charge beam, so you know how much you got charged up. Also, this is the first boss? This looks insane for a first boss. What kind of first boss is this shit? It's crazy looking. I think we want to shoot it in the in the stomach. In the, in the stomach punch. Let's go for it. I think I got him. Yeah, my charge shot owns. Let's go back to... Oh, I should have looked at the boss in awesome graphics. My bad. I switched too late. I forgot to switch back. Well, whatever. Damn it! I would have been cool to see in the newer graphics. Oh well, stage one done. Let's go. Let's not let's not dilly dally too much. Let's get right into the next stages as quickly as possible, so we can actually beat 
hopefully beat both games. That'd be cool. I'd be down to beat both games if it doesn't take very long. I'm not making it in the two videos. I already got other shmups planned, so we're not changing my fucking plans. Simple as that. All right, let's start with the old school graphics. We'll make sure we switch it back for the boss. Huh, that looks interesting. The, the remade graphics. See, I wish they did this with more, more old games. Like, just do this. Make them all virtual console games so they're not that expensive. And just fucking update the graphics so they're awesome. Like, even the graphics of this game right here, this is the classic graphics. These are really fucking awesome just by themselves. In fact, I think R-Type 1 through 3 are all on Super Nintendo era, if I think about it. So it's not like some of them are on Nintendo, like, Gradius 1 and 2, I think, are both on original Nintendo. And then Gradius 3 is on Super. I think it's just R-Type 1, 2, 3 all on Super Nintendo era. That's why the graphics are so good, even on the first one. Anyway, I'm switch back to switch back to the newly remade graphics. See, like, it's not, it's much more just smoothed out, but it feels exactly the same. I like it. I like what they've done with the place. You know what I'm saying? Also, not liking what they've done with this worm thing. Get out of here, worm thing. Big worm. I'm not appreciating. Oh, got fucking crushed. But I also like that I don't lose all of my power-ups when I die. I lose some of them, but I don't lose all of them. That's pretty nice. Also, oh! Oh, there is a rapid fire button. You know, I knew that. I looked in the, you know, I, of course, I looked at the controls before we started. Also, this is the boss. Yeah, okay. I see. Man, just see how interesting the graphics are, man. I like it a lot. Also, we're fucking up this worm. That's right, worm. What you gonna do, big worm? I'm not entirely sure what I'm supposed to be shooting at other than his body, so I'm just gonna keep firing until something happens. Are we supposed to shoot this blue thing, maybe? I think we are. Oh, uh, maybe not. I don't know. Just keep firing until something good happens. I feel like we have another button that does something. Oh, that. Oh. That's interesting. Okay. Okay, alright, alright, I see, I see. We, ugh. I was gonna say, can we just, like, get down here and shoot this motherfucker in the eye? Where else are we supposed to shoot him? I don't know. I'm confused by what we were supposed to shoot there. That was my only problem. If I was supposed to shoot the blue eye in the middle, well, fuck. It didn't want to be shot. What was I supposed to do? And look at that, we can even switch back to the old graphics on the menu screen where we're switching to the next stage. That's pretty funny. Man, I really like, I really like the idea of this, man. I wish more... More of old games would do this. I know some. I know there's other games like this. Another one I can think of specifically that does this, where you can switch seamlessly at any time, is uh, Secret of Monkey Island, which is another game I have actually never played more than just the demo. But I know because in the demo you could do that. Also, the the other game that I'm really excited to finally play that I know you can do that with as well is the Halo Halo One Anniversary Edition, which Halo One's one of my all-time one of my all-time faves. I, I fucking love Halo 1. But, anyways, the Halo 1 Combat of all whatever, Anniversary Edition, whatever you want to call it, has the, uh, the ability to just press one button and switch between graphics from the original to the, to the remake. And I think that's just a pretty awesome feature that needs to happen in more remakes. I mean, why remake it and change it all when you can show off the awesomeness that it used to be at the same time? I mean, I, just, I feel like that's a missed opportunity. The game's already built. All you gotta do is put it on there. It's got worse graphics. It probably fits. That's not true for all games, obviously. Some games are probably pretty big. Like, you wouldn't be able to do it with, with HD games. Or, not HD games, but, like, Kingdom Hearts or something like that. Like, it would have been hard to put the original Kingdom Hearts full game alongside the original. Probably. I'm not saying it would have been. Or, like, Final Fantasy X, also another problem. Although, I think Final Fantasy X would have had lots more issues than just that. Because Final Fantasy X is, like... They had to, like, rebuild Final Fantasy X, didn't they? Also, holy shit. How was I supposed to get away from there? Oh, can I go through the ship? No, I don't think I can. What the hell are you supposed to do in this section then? Just die a lot? That's, I'm, I'm doing a good job at that. Oh my god, I keep crashing into the fucking wall. Most of my deaths there in this section have just been hitting the wall. Fuck my life. What's it look like in the old school? I actually kind of like it better in the old school. Die, you piece of shit. Die. Yeah, go back to this place. 
Yeah, suck on that. Was that the whole stage? Because I fucking sucked at that stage. Well, the whole stage was basically the boss. And I didn't even know what the hell I was doing. Well, learn the hard way. That's what they say. That's what they say. Who they are, I don't know. But that is what they say. Anyways, let's move on, shall we? Killing off some... Sa oh, my God. I'm trying to say something, and then I fucking run right into the fucking wall. I was say, about to kill off some centipede-looking motherfuckers. And then that happened. I found Spore 1 of 5? No way! What does that mean? I don't even know what that means. Found Spore 1 of 5. That sounds amazing. I hope that happens more often. I guess. Maybe. Kinda. I don't fucking know what I'm even saying. Let's just move on. Collect all the spores! I am the spore master. Collect every spore. I want some more sp- Aw, oh, you son of a bitch. I don't want any spores. I was kidding. Oh, there's a spore right there. I want it. I want it. Yeah, see? No, that's not a spore at all. That's just a... That's a familiar. I keep calling it a familiar. That's a... What do they call that shit again? I already forgot what they call that shit. Um, what was it called when you bring out a little friend? An option. That's what they called it in our type of the... Or in, in Gradius. See, now I'm getting now I'm getting the two games mixed up. I'm playing them separate times. Completely different times. And yet I'm still mixing up the name. For whatever gosh darn reason. It's just because I feel like I'm playing Gradius. Also, let's go back to the old school view and check it out. Man, the old school view for our type is so good. Why do you even need new graphics? And also, Nintendo, what were you thinking? Why does this not exist on the virtual console anymore? Fuck! I keep moving too fast into the wall. I'd probably be better off using the damn D-pad. It doesn't move you as fast. The joystick moves you around, like, less precisely. I don't know. I digress. Charge shot for the win. Hooah! Charge shot for the win. Hooah! Oh, fuck, I suck. I don't know which part of him I'm supposed to be shooting, to be honest. I have no idea. Just throw your just throw your body into him. Throw your body. Control your body. Throw your body. Control your body. Throw your body. Girl control that body. Girl control that body. Girl control that body. I work out. Girl control that body. Girl control that body. What the fuck am I singing? I work out. Walk in the club. This is what I see. Shooting up the green orbs that are shooting at me. Got passion in my shots and I ain't afraid to shoot them. Shoot them. Shoot them. Shoot them. Shoot them. Those motherfucking douches. Alright, I need to like... God damn it. I just keep running into the bullets. Like, I'm not even... It's like I'm not even trying. Man, start trying, please. Could you, could, you, could you decide to just try one of these times, you know? Seriously? Ser ser seriously? There you go. There, there you fucking go. There, there you go. See? How hard was that? There, there you fucking go. See? You just gotta learn how to use your weapons correctly. Learn how to use your weapons correctly, and you'll be just dandy, bro. Move, move. Oh, come on with this. No, go, go back over there. There you go. No, 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 no. You are not gonna hit me. You will not hit me. I will not allow you to hit me. Come here. Get over here. Now stop. Pajama time. Here, little kitties, on my lap. Guess who's back with the brand new rap? And I don't mean rap as in a new case. That motherfucker didn't want to die for me. <gasps> Woo! That bitch did not want to die. There's got to be better ways to kill some of these things, but I think it requires power-ups that I have not been getting. Simple as that. Next stage. Here we go. Also, we kept that one in old school mode for most of the stage. Kind of forgot to switch back. It's alright. It's alright. As long as we get a good mix of both, I don't really care that much. The graphics for the old school one are like better most of the time, anyways. Should probably be uh, a little more careful. Damn it! I said more careful, not less careful. Damn it! Give me that. Whatever that is, I want it. Suck it. Fire more, fire more, fire more, fire, 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 ah, fuck fire. Ah, uh, I suck, I suck, I suck too much. Stop chasing me. You homing fucks. Oh my god, you have lasers. You have lasers. Huh. Huh. Oh yeah, I'll shoot, uh, I'll shoot your booty. I'll shoot your booty off, bitch. What are those things? I don't like them. I don't like them. 
I don't like those things. God damn it. Fuck you. Yeah, it's, it's better to do the charge shot, to be honest. I can tell. Because having to hold down the rapid fire button, you don't get as strong of shots. Like you can fire like this as fast as you want to press it, and then you can you know, mix in a charge shot every once in a while. It's good stuff. It's good stuff. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Uh, huh, uh, huh, and fuck you, and, um, and, uh, fuck you, and, ah, oh, son of a bitch. Fucking assholes. Yeah, eat my fire. Let's see what this guy looks old school style. It's a, it's the dude from, Let, um, Zelda. Fucking, oh, what the hell is that thing called with all the eyeballs that come off and you have to kill them all one at a time and shit? I'm, I don't even remember what the hell that thing is called. All I know is it's a bitch. And this equals bitch as well. Oh my god. Could we just... Could we just seriously right now? Not entirely sure, uh, like, if the holding down the button or the charge shots were better. Actually, I think holding it down is a little better because I can focus on dodging, which is still not happening very well. But at least I, I can say I'm trying to dodge, even if it's not happening very well. You can utilize your little fucking homie, though. See, that's the thing. That's the thing I'm not doing is very well is... Utilizing my little homie. My little homie, not utilizing him. My little homie, fuck him in his butt. My little homie. Homie, homie. I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna kill you. Wait, what? Aw, oh, he ran away. He's one of those kind of bosses. If you don't kill him, he runs away. God, I hate those kind of bosses. What an annoying boss. Alright, we got three more stages to go. Let's do this. I at least want to try our type 2. Nah. If we can beat this in the next 10 minutes, we'll be fine. We'll be able to do both. Easy. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. We'll do all the beezies. That's what I was going for. Going for all the beezies. The BZBs and the PenZZs and the TCTs and the HTCs and the SATs and the BBB and the BBB and the BBB and the BBB. That's all, folks. Like what I did there? more where that came from. Yeah! And I don't mean how good I was playing. I mean that awesome just death mania is what is happening right now. What is... How do I even do this section? Let's look at this shit in old school style. How... Wow. It literally doesn't even look different. It looks the same. Also, my battery can't be low. That's not cool. Son of a bitch! I'm running into everything now. I suck. Stop sucking. Usually when I tell myself to stop sucking, I suck more. So prepare for that. Eat my shit. Piece of shit. Also, we need to go back. We need to go back. Oh my god, I can't go back. It won't let me go back with all these guys falling down. Always falling down, down, down. Always falling down, down. Where's my fucking familiar friend at? I can't do things without him. Without him, I am so lost. Ow! So many things to dodge. How do, dude? This, you know how much practice I would have to have to even look like I knew what I was doing in the stage. Oh my god, this stage is ridiculous. Never thought I'd see a stage this ridiculous, but yet here we are. Let's look at it in old school mode for whatever this is. The boss, I guess. I don't even know what I'm supposed to be shooting at. To be perfectly honest, to be let's be honest, honestly. In honest day, don't know what to shoot. I think I'm supposed to shoot this one because it's faced the uh, way where I can actually shoot it. Probably supposed to shoot everything, but holy fuck, dude. I am... Do you even see what is happening right now? Tell me what do you see when you're looking at me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Dude. Dude, familiar, bro. What happened? Oh, I did it again. I fucking suck so hard. That the boss was like, fuck it, he can't beat us. Just let's get out of here. <laughs> wow. <sighs> I feel so shitty when that happens. It's happened to me so much this month, like it's kinda just growing on me now. I'm like, well, fucking there it is again, it happened again. But Oh my god, and then I go and do stupid shit like that, and it's like, well, it's a good thing lives don't matter, because if they did, you would not get past the first stage, sir. Although I would I I would admittedly be trying much more focused. I wouldn't even be this far, first of all. 
That's the first, first fucking point I should be making. Wouldn't even be anywhere near this point in the game, for that matter. So I wouldn't have to suck this hard on this part of the game, because I wouldn't be here. I wouldn't be here without the game being so nice and actually letting me play these parts of the game. Also, fuck this thing for being alive at all, just existing. Also, fuck you for shooting lasers at my face. Did we kill this thing or what? You're just, you're just gonna survive? This is how you survive? Thank you for dying. You at least make me believe that somebody in this game dies for one goddamn second. So I can see one thing I should need to be utilizing is my little friend better. Like, I'm not utilizing him basically at all. And I can see how he can be very useful because you can use him to, like, kill anything near you if you understand how to use him. Like, see how he's in front of me now? I can use him for anything in front of me. Not behind, obviously. Because I'm behind, I will die. Anything in front, boom, they're dead. Boom, they're dead. You know what I'm saying? Boom, 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 bam, 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 you're dead. Bam, 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 bam. And you can basically use him as like a battering ram shield. Just watch your ass while you block everything in front of you. It seems like it's a pretty, pretty handy little dude. He's just pretty handy. He's, he's a handy dandy little dude. Like a little handy dandy little notebook. Kind of similar. You like how I'm just dying like it's, like I'm not even, like it doesn't even count that I'm dead. I'm just fucking playing the game like it's, like this is how you're supposed to play it. But yeah, dying's not a dying's not a thing. You just play in the game like nothing. Just makes you start at the beginning of the screen. It's like respawn. It's like respawn. Playing Halo all of a sudden. We're just respawning when we need to respawn. You know how that is. I'm just trying to I'm just trying to win. I'm trying to be victorious. And not have another fucking boss run away from me. I wanna win this time, damn it. Fuck you. You motherfucker. Fuck you. Oh my god. There's so many things. So many things to throw on the ground. Like this, and this, and that, and even this. What? Dude. This. I. Mm, just what even? What even would one do to actually defeat this legitimately? There's something about these bosses that I'm just. I'm not understanding that I could probably be doing that would help me immensely. And probably lead me to victory, but that thing that I should be doing eludes me to no end. Did I actually defeat it or did it just run away again? Because I feel like the boss kind of just said, fuck it, we'll commit suicide. Also, that was the second to last stage. Holy shit, that was ridiculous. Let's see what the last stage has in store because I bet you it's even more ridiculous. Let's look at it in old school first. I, I shudder to think what the final fucking boss is gonna have in store for us. Also, alien babies are flying at us, so let's 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 pay attention to that for a minute. Oh my god, alien babies! Alien babies, quit it! I don't want to play today, alien babies. Get out of my fucking life, alien babies! Get out of my life! I don't want you in my life. Cause you're the worst thing around me. You're the worst thing in my life. I want my homie to be with me Cause we can be awesome together Just me and him We are awesome together Let's go get this blue orb Because I don't know what it is Also this thing that's like flying around This little this little fucking whirly bird Flying flippity flop Thingy in front of me What the hell is it? Also are we fighting Mother Brain or what? I feel like we're fighting Mother Brain Not entirely certain But it looks kind of Mother Brainy if you ask me we keep firing. Hope not. Hopefully, hopefully, not die. There's always a hope. Not entirely sure, but always a hope. I wonder if I should be throwing. I'm just kind of waiting for something to happen. Yeah, like that. That'll do. Two whirly birds, huh? Two, two little whirly, whirly gigs, huh? You want you want to say hello, Whirly Gigs? How's it going? Oh fuck you, Whirly Gigs! I just I was kidding. I didn't want you to say hi. I didn't want you to stop by and maybe say hi. I didn't actually wish for that. God damn it! How do you? How does one even? I don't even know if I'm doing this right. Is this a, just a matter of survival? Am, am I doing anything correctly? Is my point, I guess. I know I have to hit that thing. I can see that. But, like, should I be throwing my little freaking homie at him? I feel like I should. But it doesn't go through there. You just have to, like, line it up and hope for some fucking shots. Look 
at these fucking whirly birds everywhere, man. Now wait, now it's on top of me? How the fuck are you supposed to dodge that shit? Look at that shit, that's instant death. Are you guys realizing what is happening? I don't think you guys are appreciating exactly what's happening to me right now. How do you get this thing off of you? I don't understand. It's it's just there and there's nothing you can do. Hey look, the final boss killed itself because God knows I was going to kill it. Was that the final boss? Because that was absolutely ridiculous. Look, I saved Earth, you guys. <laughs> Not impressively at all, by the way. That was terrible. Hey, look, more ships that look just like me. I'm the real R-Type. Yes, I'm the real R-Type. All you other fake R-Types are just imitating. So won't the real R-Type please stand up? Please stand up. Please stand up. I'm not reading this. Annihilated to never scare people again. Uh, your name will remain in the universe forever. Thank you for playing the game to the end. Even if you didn't actually beat it. You just played it to the end. And I will be friends till the end. But it returns in R-Type 2. So that's what we're going to do next. Here we go. Continue. How do we continue? What does continue even mean? Credits? I don't give a shit about credits. Let's check out R-Type 2. I'm excited. Infinity mode. Here we come. Alright, this one only has six stages, so it should go a little faster. Also, awesome start. Awesome soft start already. Okay. Infinity mode. Here we go. Looks exactly the same. Let's see how it looks in old school style. It, wow, this is exactly the same. There's no difference between R-Type 1 and 2 in terms of graphical or enemy setups. Or what do you call it? Enemy looks. It's setups. But the looks of the enemies are pretty much the same. Oh my god, don't you dare. Remember, this is the first stage, bro. You gotta at least do okay on the first stage. You can't die on every little goddamn thing on the first day. That's just be unacceptable. Dude, this looks exactly the same. Are you, am I sure I'm playing a different game here? Is there anything different about this? I don't think I got this power up last time. This seems like a cool little double double laser power up. I like that. I'm gonna go ahead and rapid fire that shit now. Rapid fire that shit. Watch out for these motherfucking uh, fucking crunch crunch tastic. Whores. Oh my god. Crunchtastic whores. I don't like it. I don't like Crunchtastic whores. My bullets are kind of ruining the, the, the mood, bro. You're ruining the mood, bullets. You may be awesome, but you're ruining the mood. Meaning the music. The music is the mood, though. Look at this shit. This is... Maybe that's the whole point, though. R-Type 2 is supposed to be like, first stage is throwback to the first game, bro. Then we start throwing some crazy new shit at you. I feel like that's what's going to happen here. I feel like this stage is very much similar to the first stage of the first game. Which is fine. I mean, like I said, that, that's kind of what these games do. Like, even in something like Gradius, the first, Gradius 3, the first stage was hella like a Life Force stage. Which is not surprising to me at all. Lasers! Lasers! Eat my lasers, eat my lasers, eat my motherfucking lasers, and I also have them dropping bombs like a motherfucking beast. Oh wow, those bombs like blow up in front of you. Yeah, this is totes like the boss. Oh yeah, we didn't even do new graphics. We started new graphics, but we went old immediately. This time we'll get to see the first boss in old school, or new school mode, I mean. Shoot the big red dot. Oh my god. Don't die though. Too late. Ship has sailed. Death immediately. All right, now that I know that happens, awesome. Also amazing. Yeah, we're pretty much amazing. I don't know if there's anywhere else we can actually shoot this thing other than the big red eye. But, uh, let's go ahead and just throw that, throw that back there. Oh, we got him. Never mind. It's cool. Just a few hundred lives later, it's cool. Stage one, clear. Oh yeah, beast mode. Going on to stage two. Going on to stage two, baby. All right. Oh yeah, all right. All right, we got underwater half, overwater half. Don't know what that really means, but prepare for lots of bullshit, I imagine. I guess when I shoot these guys, oh, okay, I see. 
when you shoot them, they decide to go flying into wherever they're facing. I see. I see. Understandable. I would kamikaze myself too if I got shot in the face, wouldn't you? Isn't that how it works? You want to kamikaze yourself when you shoot, get shot in the face, right? I mean, that's how I imagine I would feel. Oh yeah, I have nothing else to live for. I got shot in the face. It's like I've done everything in life. I got shot in the face. Game over. What else is there to experience? Alright, just fucking die, you flying mole things. God damn it, they didn't even kill me. I ran into the goddamn fucking ground, you idiot. You fucking idiot. You're a gosh darn diggity dang idiot. You heard me. I like how I'm insulting myself, and I'm telling myself I hurt myself. That's just, that's A+. Plus, A++, plus plus, C++, plus plus, A+, plus, A+, plus, C+. Plus. Is that equal? Equals something. I can't share with you at this current moment in time because I don't know. I just don't feel like it, I guess. Uh, too many things. Too many things. I can't dodge anymore. I suck too hard at this game to dodge everything. I cannot dodge. I cannot dodge these sperms. These sperms are all over the place. Sperms get everywhere. Sperms get in between the cracks. The cracks where the sperm get. I cannot get to. No, I cannot. For then I cannot. Of this I am sure. Of this I am sure. Oh fuck you for blowing up into multiples. That was garbage. That was that was garbage man status. Haven't you ever heard of the garbage man? Do you know the garbage man? The garbage man? The garbage man? Yes, I know the garbage man. Wow, this actually looks more awesome in the old school mode. What the hell am I doing? Why am I not just playing in the old school mode all the time? Also I was scratching my neck on that one. Thank you for that game. Thank you oh so very much for that. Also, I should be underwater killing all these things because they're just killing me. They just, they just killing me. You know what? Fuck them. Fuck them all. Does this actually do more damage if I just fucking shoot along the water like this? That, that seems like a cool new mechanic that I didn't even notice you could do. Shoot along the water and just do damage. Just throw down damage like a madman. Also, ah, uh, things behind. Go get them. Go get them, shield the butt shield. A butt shield. Protect my butt. Also missiles. Love them. Leave, love them. Leave them. Never want to be them. Or something like that. I'm, I'm very much enjoying these old school graphics. I don't even know if I want to switch back to the new ones. I like this. I should probably at least see what this boss looks like in the new status. Yeah, dude, it looks better in the old one. It just does. I gotta say, the bosses in this game, or these games, more than one, look a lot better in the old school mode. They do. They just do. They look a lot cooler. They look like coo too cool for scoo, bro. Too scoo for boo boo. Scooby dooby dooby doo, bro. Keep firing on them, firing on them, and firing on them. Yanada, yanada, yanada. Ah, I'm doing so well, too. Fucking waterfall, move! I wonder if I should use a charge shot on them. Oh, come on with this. You can't. Can't do a little squat squat maneuver when I'm right there. Son of a bitch. Wait, don't stay underwater. You're supposed to come above water, you piece of shit. Gonna start changing your shitty ass strategy now, you piece of shit. Oh my god, you're an asshole, sir. You are A grade A plus assholian motherfucker. There we go. I like how they blow up hella metal slug style too. They blow up hella like metal slug bosses do. Like boom, 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 Big time explosion style. Stage you clear. Oh yeah. Almost halfway. We're two. We're already one. Whoa. What? Uh. Okay. I accidentally. Accidentally went back. That was my bad. I didn't even realize that was that easy to do. Just press circle and go back. All right. We're cool. We're cool. Everything's cool. Everything's okay, guys. I'm still on the fucking stage I left off on. It's okay. It's okay. Also, we're gonna keep dying. So. Keep on preparing for more funky deaths. They're not very funky, they're just more sad, but they're, if you consider funky deaths me dying, personally, then yeah, good funky deaths. Oh, fuck you with your one bullet, stray bullshit, your stray bullshit bullet. For some reason, this reminds me of the first stage of Mega Man X. Also, why would I make a reference like that when I've never really played Mega Man X other than watching somebody else play it of course but I've never really played it much myself 
only tried it a little bit. And yes, I know, for a big Mega Man fan such as myself, I have not played much of any Mega Man X games ever. So, if that gets you hyped up for what possibilities may happen on this channel, good. Because they have, there's many plans for Mega Mans on this channel. I'll just say that. And we'll leave it at that. Eventually, of course. It's not like it's next or anything, but it is eventually. I do want to play me some Mega Mans. I love me some Mega Mans. I really do. Also, die big ships. Big ships? Oh, come on with this. Come on with your bullshit. Seriously? Come on with your bullshit, man. Fire! Hot like fire, hot like fire, hot like fire, hot like fire. Oh, I can't dodge all the bullets. Oh my god, too many bullets. Too many bullshit bullets. Too many bullshits! Man, I suck at this game. <laughs> it is not any better than Gradius. In fact, it is just as bad, if not worse, than Gradius. The only good thing is, is the fact that we're playing a remake version that lets me have as much goddamn hot lives as I need to just see the whole game and not put me back at a bullshit checkpoint where I have to re -keep, re keep redoing an area. Now, if that was the case, I might be able to get through some of the stages. It would just take me longer, obviously. But I'm kind of glad we just kind of get to see the game like it's an arcade style. It's like, how many quarters did I use to beat this game? We'll find out when we get to the end, even though it probably doesn't tell me how many times I actually died. It should, if it doesn't. But I don't think it does. I don't like these big fucks. These big fucks aren't fucking fuck fuckity fuck fuck. I don't like them. Right, at this point, I'm just trying to get by them without dying a million times. Just half a mil. Half a mil's good. A million? Too many. But half a mil, I can live with. Also, time for the bows. What do we got this time? Looking. See, I like that it looks more bony when you the old school version. In the new version, it's like it looks too mechanical. But in the old one, it looks like it's a fucking big bone. It's like a giant bone. It's the rib bone connected to the something else bone. It's the motherfucking bony bone, bony bone, 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 bone. Oh, you bitch. Oh, we're inside now, bitch. It's over. It's over now. You gonna wish I was never inside. Oh, man. Not cool. Get that blue. Get that blue. Bitch. You're a bitch tastic bitch. I say to you, you are a bitch tastic bitch. And what you say to me, you are a bitch tastic bitch. I'm actually beat this boss. We just have to cheat to do it. I have to fucking waste our lives just to get this fucker. Fucking die. Thank you. Yeah, they really do blow up like metal slug bosses. I like, I like it a lot. I like it a lot. And for those of you who don't come to my streams. I also mentioned somewhere in one of those that I said I would play some Metal Slug on my channel at some point as well. Also, it does say how many lives you've used. Awesome. It probably says how many lives you've done like on your best run, how many lives it took you. That's probably what it is. The fact that any stage took me under 10 lives is amazing, even the first one. In fact, I'm quite impressed with myself for only dying four times on the first stage. And I think like half of those were, oh fuck, that wasn't even, does that mean, how much did you even count, man? But I feel like most of the deaths in the first stage were at the boss. I didn't die much along the way. Pieces of shit. You don't want none of it. <sighs> I don't know if it's better to rapid fire or hold down their shots. I feel like the hold down shot is so much more useful because things die in one hit. Especially when they don't die in one hit normally. God, I love the explosion on everything. It's just so good. So good. Such a such a satisfying explosion. Also, that's a that's a wall. Yeah, I, I wasn't getting anywhere there. And again, these shmups prove to have parts where you just have to know the stage, otherwise you will die. Good lord, man. How does one destroy this game? I might have to watch a playthrough of this game too. Just to see people destroy them. Cause like I could see Gradius. Like I could totally see how you could do Gradius. That was easy to like see how it could be done. This one, the power-ups are not quite the same done the same way. So I'd be very curious to see how to do this one like beast mode status. Since like obviously it requires a lot of memorization. That's not a surprise, but like how do you manage your weapons in this one to make it so you just kick the shit out of everything? Because you don't really choose weapons as far as I can tell. You just kind of have what you have and you, I mean, you pick up some stuff, but you're not like, oh, I want 
to, you know, redeem my weapon now because I'm going to get the one I want. It's not like that. It's like, here's the weapon you pick up. Here's what you get. Also, fuck this part. Oh my god, this is gonna this is gonna be a minute. Fucking bosses. Or if I should just be holding the shit down. I was trying to do charge shots, but I might be better off just dodging and firing with this. Okay, well that works. My charge shots actually weakened him a lot. Sweet. Stage four done. Two thirds of the way through. Only two more stages to go, bro. I'm kind of interested to see if if we finish both of these and we get uh, R Type three for a minute. That'd be cool. I honestly don't know if it has R-Type 3 on this collection, this R-Type Dimension shit. I, I mean, I'm gonna be, it's gonna be cool if it does, but I honestly have no fucking clue. It was just, I was just a manager, manager, manager? It just happened to be a guest, so let's just hope that it does. That'd be, that'd be cool to check out the third one. We might not be able to uh, have time to play all the third, well, fuck, who said we don't have time? We got time, I got time, we all got time. Time ain't going nowhere. I can see here and play the third one too. Shit, my original plan was to play one of these R-types and I'm end up playing all three of them. Wouldn't that be amazing? Even if it is the noob way. At least you'll get to see the whole game and see how ridiculous it would be to even be good at this game. And again, some of you guys that are watching this are probably like, Man, I can beat this game. We don't even die. I do the whole first stage, man. I do all the stages. I don't even die one time, man. I mean, shit, I've seen that on Gradius already. Fucking crazy ass motherfuckers. But I can see it. I can see it be done. Like, even when I'm playing the game, I'm like, I can totally see how someone can do this. This one, I just don't see how you could. Like, you just have to know everything about the fucking stage. To dodge it, to get out of the way, to kill it faster, to know what weapons you might get. If it's more randomized, you might not ever know what weapons you're going to get. But still, like, it's it'd be interesting to see for sure. Probably just something about this, like, the little familiar, like, the little homie guy that you get for the whole time. I'm probably not utilizing him as well as I should either. Like, you're probably supposed to use him to, like, actually, I don't know, do something. But I'm just, like, letting him, just kind of letting him be. He's just there. I'm not utilizing him whatsoever. Kind of squandering his skills, so to speak. Probably not the way you're supposed to play this game. Just dying to aliens. You know, the usual dying to aliens that are just endless fucking waves of aliens dying to dragon heads who just leave behind bullshit fucking dragon head thingies all right i probably can charge shot through some of the stuff through that like through those sections and i was just doing the regular shots this feels very boss like what do i do okay yellow thing. Okay, I feel like we need to get over to the boss and actually shoot him. Oh, I see. We have to shoot those bubbles. Okay. We have to shoot the big blue boobles. Keep starting at the other end of the screen. We're never going to get the kills. Oh, just... Oh, my God. Why? Why? Got one. At this point, I don't even care. I just want to kill it. Alright, one more, one more. We got this. Oh, can we actually shoot the walls? I didn't really notice we could shoot the walls, like, to, to bend to our will. That was my bad on that. I thought, literally, the walls were just reacting to the enemies, but they're reacting to me as well. Okay. That I didn't realize. If I'd have realized that, I probably could have done a little bit better than dying a million times on that. Hey, look, I only died 21 times. Not a million. Here comes the final stage. Here we go. Stage 6. We boot. Oh boy, dragging on my ass already. Good start. Dragging on my ass, boys. Wee, wee, wee. Dragging on my ass, boys. Wee, rowdy. Dragging on my ass, boys. Boys, boys, boys. Dragging on my ass, boys. Wee, rowdy. Dragging on my ass, boys. What, what, what? Dra Holy fucking aliens, man. Aliens everywhere, man. How are you supposed to do this? It's too many things. Too many things. And they all go right for you. It's like, how do you dodge that many things going right for you? How does one? How does one even? There's a way. What is this way? Somebody show me. I want you to show me. I, I mean, as much as I complain about how bad I am at these, like, a big part of each one of these shmups that I play is memorizing the stages. And obviously playing them blindly, all you're going to see is failure and pain and just anguish. You're not going to see success. 
like the game has to be easy for there to be success otherwise you're just gonna see absolute failure which is what you get for most of these games so I don't know why I'm even like expecting to do anything on these fucking things if anything I just hope that they have modes like this where I can just learn the game like this this game is perfect for a guy like me who if he wants to actually get good at a game like this he can just practice whatever stage he wants to practice until he gets good at the stage and then you can try the next stage and do the same thing and you, you just gotta unlock all the stages through this mode and that's it it's all you gotta do and that's simple enough in in theory so that's good it's good see and I'm just like I said I'm just dying willy-nilly like it doesn't even matter because it kind of doesn't also dragon get out of my face fuck you but I think I make a good point there though like Yes, I know I'm dying a lot, and it probably doesn't need to be as bad as I make it, but still, like I said, most of it requires you to know the levels. Like, if you don't know the levels, you're never going to know what to expect, when to dodge, all that good stuff. Also, what the fuck is this? We need to we need to see this in new, new school mode. Okay, it opened up. Shoot the, shoot the skull inside. I got it. I got this. Yeah, oh, maybe I should go in there and just fuck him up. I'm gonna try it. Let's go up in here and just fuck him up. Yeah, let's look at that shit. Look at that shit. Fucking him up. Fucking him up. I'm not even gonna move. Just fuck him up. Wake me up when it's over. Oh, man. Did you see how ridiculous that was? I was destroying that motherfucker. Alright. So now that one's dead. What now? Can we kill the guns? Honestly, I don't know what's next. What do we do next? We have to kill. Do I have to squeeze my ass back here? Probably. How do you do it, though? Wait, can you, like. You might be able to, like. Hold on. You might be able to blow open a hole in the back of this thing? Maybe? Stop dying for a second? Move out of the way, hole. Might be able to blow a hole in this. Maybe? Hard to say for sure. Damn it. I'm trying to, I'm trying to figure this out, game. Stop being an asshole. I think I'm actually hitting the brain in the back. Yeah, I am. Just got to utilize your shot. Ugh, the charge shot, man. Who fuck that thing? Look at that shot. It's how do you you can't dodge that. You can't. You can't even dodge that. You can't. At this point, I'm just trying to fucking kill him because this is stupid. All right. I don't know if I actually killed him or a fucking cheap killed him. Either way, the motherfucker died. Is that it? Can I say I completed R-Type 2? think so. Got the scarred hero. Very scarred. I'm scarred for life hero, more like. But it was fun. I had my fun. Let's, let's go back to old school mode. Oh, yeah. Look at those explosions. Oh, it feels so metal sluggy. I love it. Love it. Enjoy all the explosion mans. I like it. I like it a lot. Come on, Luke Skywalker. Get your ass out of there. Stop trying to be cool and showing off and shit. I'm trying to show off. Is that what you're trying to do, Luke? Oh, he's going to blow a hole open to get out of there. Aren't he? he needs all of his R-Type homies. Yeah. Now we're talking. Awesome. Yay, we win. You're done. You win, son. You win. Wow, that one took a lot less time than the first one did. The battle is over. The Bido Empire, which was attempting to expand its territory over this wide galaxy, collapsed here. Many planets were invaded by the evil empire and turned into Death Stars, but are now recovering to their original shapes. Thus, the universe is restoring peace. Thank you for saving us. You're welcome, universe. I guess that's all. Game over. Is that all for today's... Shmup Timber, or are we actually going to get a chance to play us some motherfucking R-Type 3? Well, if R-Type 3 is on this game, I haven't unlocked it. 
Something tells me it is, but I don't know how to unlock it. It probably requires you to beat the games legitimately, which will never happen, so I guess I'm never going to play R-Type 3. Oh, somebody come to my house and beat this for me, please? Somebody? Anybody? Is this thing on? Anybody still here? Alright, see you guys tomorrow for some more September. Bye-bye. Peace.